Like candles burn in Chandler for a mom taken from her family in an instant. Steve Irvin showing us how those loved ones are now returning to the place she was killed near Ray and College to remember a beautiful spirit and demand justice. She was always smiling, always giving, and looking out for others, especially her little ones. Pamela Hesselbacher had her dream life, the family she'd always wanted. Pamela was such a bright spirit. She was happy and considerate and um, really dedicated as a mom and a wife. Just looking at them and she said, this was enough. This is all I need. I have my sweet little boy and my sweet little girl, and they were her life. Pamela was just out for a walk near her home with three-year-old Ryan and one-year-old Audrey. They were in the crosswalk. A driver speeding through the red light hit them. Pamela died moments after arriving at the hospital. Her children severely injured. Her youngest remains in a coma. That driver, 39-year-old William Epperline, had a suspended license and a history of drunk driving. He was arrested, charged, then inexplicably released. Pamela's family wants to know why. It's a history of reckless driving and how it finally killed somebody and he didn't even spend a night in jail. Pamela's family says they believe in the justice system, but there will never truly be justice. Nothing brings a mom back. Nothing fulfills a life unlived or dreams never realized. Steve Irvin, ABC 15.